Kurt with Kurt Tanner Motor Cars. Today we have on offer this 1973 Triumph TR6 convertible. Mimosa yellow with chestnut interior, four speed standard wheels, chrome luggage rack, early style European bumpers. Quite a nice attractive car here. Um, speedometer reads there it is, 83,440. And we purchased this car recently. I think we bought it from uh, St. Louis, Missouri area. And um, the, the owner of this car was an older gentleman. He left it to his son. I think his son had it stored in the garage for maybe like uh, 10 years. Just had it running and driving and played with it a bit. But we bought it, we brought it in. We. Uh, we did some tune-up work on it, had it detailed. It's quite the good driver. It's, it, it feels to me just like a very genuine 80,000 mile car. Um, paint work, as you can see, is pretty decent on it. It is an older paint job with a couple little chips, but, but, uh, but still plenty of life left in it. Tires are new, so they look great. But yeah, let's just go around it slowly, panel by panel really good gaps chrome's good a couple little chips along the nose here uh, let's see not too much going on little chip here and here um, I believe at one point this fender has been off because it, it's not quite sitting perfectly flush here but that's an easy fix just to just to tighten that gap up um, but yeah, pretty good paint. It's had one repaint in its original mimosa color, but very good body, very straight, rust-free. The only rust I found all over the whole body on the car was a little bit of bubbling on this corner, which is, uh, you know, when you stand back here, you don't even notice it. So that, but that, you can only notice that up close. So, uh, so pretty good little car. Uh, amazingly, a perfect dash top pad. This is all the original dash. Looks like it could use some uh, some crash pads and the little the switch plinth here, but the uh, the center console is perfect on the car. Very original interior, highly original. Nothing's ever been changed on this car. Um, you can see this the, the the pole bar here is starting to deteriorate. You can see the driver's seat needs foam and a bit of vinyl repair, and. Um, passenger seat looks great yeah there is a tear here and then another tear in the seat there and you can see the padding's just kind of let go on it but amazingly with this car all original carpets if you lift this house flooring up you can uh, you can see all the original carpets are there being protected but all in here is original original door seals which is pretty amazing um, original original dark brown top boot there is a black top under there in, in fair condition let me show you the trunk here the trunk is kind of as you would expect a nice original car to be you know jack books tools um, original factory tonneau cover in perfect condition most of them are because they don't get used too often but uh, yeah real nice driver Real nice driving car. Um, if you push it hard, it uh, it does show a little bit of wandering on the front end, but that, that's just typical for um, for the age of the car. You know, just being a, a highly original, eighty thousand mile car. Um, probably could do with it maybe some ball joints or some bushes, but but you know, it does go down the road nicely. It is pretty safe. Um, an interesting thing to this car is it, it's fitted with a set of these uh, Spanish-made aftermarket Weber carbs. So let's look under the hood here, and I'll show you that. So the car came in with these uh, these side draft Webers. They're pretty interesting, but but yeah, highly original engine compartment all around here. Never been touched really. Never been painted. Um, so this is all the original Mimosa yellow all the way around even the back of the hood is the original paint and then it's fitted like i was saying with these 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 are single throat weber carbs they work pretty well they've got this choke set up once warmed the car really performs brilliantly with them so you can see me on the video uh, driving around 
and uh, you know giving this car some pretty good gas and it uh, it does it does perform real well. Um, windshield here is original; it's in decent shape. The rubber's decent. So uh, let's look at this in the interior side of this. Um, good door panel. There's the dash again. There's the really original interior. So, so yeah, highly original, um, 83,000 mile car with one repaint and the rest of the car is, uh, is quite original, great running driving. Let me shut this hood here. Yeah, the hood shuts nicely. Um, but I really like these Euro bumpers, these, these earlier style clean bumpers without the big rubber pads. They're great. Wheels are in good shape. Yeah, so good little driver. Great little driving car for the summer. Um, real attractive. Uh, runs, drives, stops, steers, does everything mechanically well. Feels like a really genuine 80,000 mile TR6. And there it is. 1970. Yeah, 1973. We got two of these cars, so I got to get the years right. But yeah, 1973 Triumph TR6 convertible, Mimosa on chestnut, four speed, steel wheels, which are the real attractive original steel wheels, chrome luggage rack, 80 plus thousand original miles, runs and drives pretty nicely. And uh, it's for sale right now. Just came on the market today on our website, www.hurtannermotorcars.com.